In this video, revealing how to start a print-on-demand business and how complete beginners are making money literally on day one with no experience. More with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days. Check it out now. So it's pretty obvious, especially with all the things that has happened with the world in the past couple of years, that e-commerce is here to stay and e-commerce is taking over. And in fact, if you don't at least tap into the e-commerce potential of how fast it's growing, that you might potentially miss out, right? And the reason why I wanted to get started in e-commerce wasn't because I wanted to miss out, was because I just saw it as a good potential. Like here was me stuck in a place that I did not enjoy, looking out the window wondering when would I be able to be free? When would I be able to travel around the world? When would I be able to do things that I love instead of doing the things that I felt like I was forced to do? But I just didn't have any skills, I didn't know how to go ahead and sell stuff, I didn't want to show my face on camera. But I wanted to do all these things. Well e-commerce is one of those ways that you can learn some simple skills and actually start making money. And you can see when I started making money, I was like, screw this, I'm gonna grab my ukulele, take this and start traveling around the world. And with e-commerce, we literally went from five grand to literally 1.6 million that first year, right? And obviously like my entire life changed. Uh, granted that wasn't like all profit, like that was maybe 30% profits. And you know, I started literally taking these skills and moving them to other businesses, right? Um, and one of those businesses that people can get started in e-commerce, if they're like, well Mike, I don't have any experience, I just wanna get started, is literally a concept known as print on demand, because it's like e-commerce, but instead of you having to spend your own money on your own inventory, which of course is like risky, you could leverage the fact that somebody else has already spent money on the inventory and you just literally capitalize on that. And your goal is very, very simple and it's, it's not even that hard. And like I said, when it comes to making money on day one, say you're like, okay, hey, Mike, you know what? I wanna make money with e-commerce, I wanna make money with print on demand. What would I need so that the first day that I launch, I could start making money? Well, you really need four things. You need to automate your sales, your marketing, your product, and your product delivery. So the moment you master all four of those in print on demand is the moment you could actually make money on day one as long as you have your ducks lined up in a row. Does that make sense? So one way that you could obviously do that is literally with Amazon and it's for free because think about it, Amazon, sales, they do it for you. Marketing, they do it for you. Millions of people already buy from Amazon every single day, right? Products, they literally have places where you could sell print on demand on Amazon for free, literally for free. And then, you know, for example, the delivery, it's automatic because it's literally through Amazon. So what are the ways that you could go ahead and do this, right? Like for example, just type in merch.amazon.com and you could sell designs as Amazon products reaching millions of customers worldwide at no upfront investment or cost to you, meaning it's free, okay? And the coolest thing about this is because it's free, it's almost like no risk but you get to go ahead and sell them as if they were already Amazon products. And the moment, for example, someone goes and types in the word, uh, I don't know, cat t-shirt, all of these things that pop up, these are what people are searching for. The moment someone buys one of these t-shirts, right, Merch.Amazon literally sees it, they print the design on the t-shirt, ships it directly to the customer at no cost to you, and you get paid passive income from it. And some of these designs could essentially make you $100 a month. So if you wanna make money, you literally just design like, okay, well, what if I get 10 designs to pay me $100 a month? What if I get 100 designs paying me $100 a month? And you literally break it down like that. Does that make sense? Now, the moment you go ahead and do that, it's very, very interesting to see how you make money. The name of the game is finding low competitive keywords and having a bunch of designs already ready for those keywords, right? Because if you wanna make money on day one, the moment you sign up for Merch.Amazon, you need to have this prepared. So how can you get this prepared? Well, number one, you wanna go and like literally test it from other like demographics. Um, one of the places that I like going is Pinterest. Like I'll literally type in the word cat t-shirt, right? And this is literally preparing for the day one launch. I'll see all of these designs that I enjoy, right? And all of these designs, if I don't see them existing on this cat t-shirt example, then it would be a good idea to go ahead and maybe launch on Amazon. So I would screenshot it, right? I would not only do this for cats, but I would do this for every single other animal known to man. Like I have a beagle, right? So I could do beagle gifts. Look at this, people are searching for beagle gifts for women. And I would take all of the things that worked for cats and I would move them over to beagles. And you can see beagles, there's a lot less like competition, a lot less t-shirts for certain other keywords. 
12 reviews. I would even do it, like even, what, what, what else are like pretty crazy stuff, right? Um, people are also into elephants. So elephant gifts for women, right? Let's see if there's any t-shirts on here, right? You can see that there's only one t-shirt, only 40 reviews, right? Um, and you can see here's another one. This one has like a lot of reviews. Another one that I also did it was like, for example, Jesus t-shirts. Look at this, Jesus shirts for women. Look at this, only two reviews and it's on the first page. So I would literally just take all these designs and just move them over to different niches and just start having like a huge, you know, for example, like portfolio of like designs. Now, if you wanna make the designs yourself, it's simple. You could literally go to Canva, it's free. You could just type in the word t-shirt and they have all these templates that you could go ahead and just click, right? Like if I wanna go ahead and make a design based off of something that I saw, right? I could literally just come in and like do something like this. I could change up the words. This is my t-shirt design. You could see all these other things that they have. They have all these templates that you could go ahead and use. You could just download it and then like upload it onto Merch that Amazon. Remember, if you wanna do it on the first day, you need to have all of the keywords that you wanna rank for that have low competition as well as all of the designs, okay? Another place you go to is for example, Upwork, where you could just type in the word graphic designer. Scroll down, type in location, click on the word Philippines. Hourly rate, $10 an hour and below. And you could actually see all these people are literally gonna go ahead and do this for you for $5 an hour, $5 an hour. Here's one, $6 an hour, 100% job success. And what I did is I just took all the designs that I made and I would just give it to these people and they would go ahead and make it and I would literally get like $2 a design. Does that make sense? And you can start breaking down the math. Like the moment you wanna go ahead and launch this, you have all these designs, you have all these keywords that you wanna rank for just by searching for it because literally, look at this. Amazon will literally tell you what people are searching for right? And usually like upload it on day one, right? And once you have all of that portfolio of designs, it's a lot easier to make money because guess what? It's free to upload them on the Merch by Amazon. And it's literally, you make money from probability, okay? It's like the law of averages, right? Like, you know, like that old Bible verse, like, okay, well, if I only had one seed and I throw it, what's the odds of that literally going to go and turn into like into fertile soil and turn into a crop, okay? But what if I just have a bunch of seeds and I keep on throwing them? Some might be eaten by the birds. Some might fall into like, for example, like, like some unfertile ground or rocky soil. Some might be taken away by the wind, but some eventually will fall into fertile soil. So that's kind of like the approach that you want to make, especially if you want to make money on day one. Well, how else can then you can make money if you want to have your own brand? Well, here's one way that people are going ahead and doing it. Here's an example, like if you go and create your own Shopify store. And a very good example of someone that really did this to a T is fanjoy.com. Now, as you can see, fanjoy literally has all these like print on demand, like t-shirts and whatnot. And yet they have like 10 to $25 million in sales. And how they do it is they partner with, for example, creators. And these creators essentially do the marketing for, you know, their products, right? So again, let's break that down. Sales, marketing, product, product delivery. How would we break this down? Sales happens on Shopify. Very simple, right? You literally create the store in five minutes, you could have a bunch of t-shirts up in there, right? Now, in terms of the marketing, where do you find that? Well, you could find cheap creators, if I just type in the word cat tips, on YouTube. If I just type in the word cat tips, what I wanna find is people that have a lot of views with very, very, I mean like very, very little subscribers. And you could actually see it, right? Like if I keep on scrolling down, you'll see that they'll eventually show themselves. Here's a really good example of this one, Mia Stone, look at this. 600,000 views, only, uh, for example, 4,000 subscribers, right? You could come in here and reach a bunch of these people hey that have this like on their YouTube channel, just go to their about, and you could see that you could like have their email address right there and you could literally reach out to them and say, hey, you know, like I create t-shirts for a living, I could create an own collection for you. And when someone literally goes and buys through your collection, I'll literally go ahead and for example, you know, like split the profits with you, right? And what you wanna do if you wanna make money on day one, you wanna start building up, you know, like a network of these influencers that have low subscribers but high views, because then you could like knock it all out of the park. The sales is on Shopify, right? And the marketing is literally on, you know, YouTube or these influencers. That's exactly how Fanjoy did it and just blew up, right? So what about the products? The products are very simple. You can literally get the designs kind of like what I showed you, model things that were on Amazon or on Pinterest. And the product delivery, you could upload it onto Printful. Now Printful is free, no open fees, no order minimums, and the only time you buy the product is after you've made the sale. So it's very low risk, right? 
And you can see all of the products that they have from t-shirts to leggings, to phone cases, to bags, to jackets, to swimwear, to dresses, to all these things. And the craziest thing is they also connect with Etsy, with eBay, with Amazon. So you could go ahead and even sell all these products as Amazon products as well, right? So all of these methods alone, if you have the sales, the marketing, the product, and the product delivery set up on day one, then you could essentially make money. Does that make sense? And that's how people are literally going in and doing it. Of course, this might take effort. This might take hard work. This might take hustle. But this way is one of like the lowest risk ways to get started in print on demand. But of course, these are just some ways to make money. If you want a faster and easier way to make passive income, we literally have people in our community go from zero to literally 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks with this brand new method. Then sign up for this week's free workshop below and check out this video on this podcast right here. Hopefully, this helps. I love you guys. See you guys later. Woo!